wrong. I'm not lying. Uh, but to be honest, it is kind of too much. I have to say, like you, you shouldn't really stitch the same pattern for hundred meters. It it will take two years, and you might not. At some point, you get tired. Like I don't hate it, but I just get bored. So I was kind of wrong for that. So please. You know, enjoy the patterns as well. Pattern matters too. But Sashiko is not the word for the pattern. That that's completely different. Sashiko is not word f sorry, Sashiko is not the word for technique, style, pattern. What else? Or oh, even the size of stitches, it's not a style. It, it's none of those. Many people say that Sashiko is the pattern's name or Sashiko is the word for technique. It is not. It is not. It is more than that. The technique and patterns are a very important part of Sashiko. But if we define that Sashiko as the technique, we will lose a lot of important sense. So, um... It is easy for them, for others, to say that Sashiko is the technique because that's what they would like to learn. At the same time, as the one who practiced Sashiko, I feel I will need to explain the bigger picture, which include a lot more. So once we lose the upstream of those practice or culture, we will lose the uh, wealthiness in front of us. We can use the water in front of us thanks to the river we might have nearby. And the river will provide us the water, but any water river comes from the upstream. When we ignore those upstream and when we start kind of not caring about it, after all, at some point, we will lose the clear water or, you know, the water we can use almost unlimited. It is very important to not to contaminate those water for the people after us. So it is one way to care the sustainability and probably the majority of the sustainability right now is like that. How can we protect something we have to the next generation, to the people underneath of the river. It's nice, it's very really caring, we have to respect each other. So we have something, if we use that water, if we make it dirty, we should make it clean and then go back to the water river. And that's that's a very, very important part of the sustainability and that's something we have to do, we should be doing. At the same time, we need to really look at look for what is the upstream and no matter how we we do well in terms of keeping something clean for the next people in the line if we ignore the upstream we may lose that we may lose the pri privilege we have right now i'm talking about river right now <laughs> i'm talking about water source right now um, but it happens, it, the same thing goes to the culture, I believe. And the best way you can do is just to acknowledge that. I'm not asking something huge. And there's not, you, know, you don't need, there's, there are no need to protect it by some other power, like law, intellectual properties I mentioned. Those restriction will protect some of it, at the same time it will slim, it, it will simplify the culture practice itself. So what we can do is acknowledge, I'm not saying the sashiko in English is wrong, it's not wrong, it's just simplified. Um, but many people believe that simplified sashiko is the answer, and those simple answer which can be the instant gratification, will uh, unfortunately change the culture itself. And those change often, in this case, Sashiko's case, they do not include the Japanese Sashiko practitioners. 
So I hope that you can keep, you know, you, you look, there's nothing specific that you have to do. I ask you to do. It's just keep acknowledging. I hope I hope you can keep enjoying sashiko. And yeah, so I, you know, you're doing everything. You're here to listen to what I'm saying. My shenanigans and you know mumbling. That, that's the acknowledgement already. Um, the fact that I can speak today, the fact that I'm recording this, uh, somebody else might be looking at later on. That will help us to preserve this culture. All right. Um, thank you so much for the live streaming. I will be gone. Uh, I will be back next Thursday. Is it's not gonna be Christmas, right? Twenty first. So yes, I should be back. <laughs> The Christmas doesn't matter to me actually, uh, because you know I'm not a Christian and my family is not a Christian, so I would do the live streaming on the 24th anyway. Uh, but yeah, I will be back on next Thursday. And uh, if you're looking, if you're watching this live streaming as the archive, your question is always welcome. I might not be able to answer some of the questions. I don't answer.